attack it, you're confident and aggressive, and um, you can get easy, you can get easy looks in transition. And that's what we did all night. Like, uh, wide open jumpers and open layups. Well, I mean, we gotta give a lot of uh, credit to our coaches and our staff here. They did a good job for, uh, preparing us yesterday. Uh, we spent hours looking at, at their film and scouting them. So uh, we came in today. We knew everything about them. Your excitement level for being headed to the Sweet 16. If you can hear the noise in this locker room, it was pretty loud in here. So um, we're all pretty excited. Nick, they wanted to run with you. Yeah, I mean, we were, we were really out there having fun. That's how we like to play. We like to get up and down. We don't, um, we don't want to run plays and we can go up there and get alley dunks and over three. So we had a lot of fun. What was the biggest, I mean, the way Mitch McGarry realized for his rebounds and how important is that for the young guys? Yeah. You guys to step yeah. up? No, that's huge. Uh, I mean, that's big for his confidence moving forward. And that's big for the team. We have other guys um, who are stepping up and, and having 20 points, 14 rebounds, whatever you want to take. That's, and that's huge for the team. And like I was saying the other day, um, when we got guys doing that, I think we're a really hard team to stop. What was Coach's message to you guys in here after the game? I mean, he didn't really have a message. He was just excited. We were, uh, we were just giving credit to everyone on this team for the job they did. We've had a lot of people saying, got to get out of this round or, you know, it's a kind of a disappointment. Did you feel any of that? And was it a relief as well? Um, I mean, I, I definitely think we would have been disappointed if we lost, but I don't know. Um, I'm not really sure. We, we, we didn't really come in with that mindset. We just wanted to win today's game, and, and we're just really happy we did. What does it mean to be going to the Sweet 16, and how long can you say that Yeah, I mean, it's, it's huge. Just obviously, this team hasn't done it in a really long time. Um, just for, this, for, the, for, like, for the young guys in this team, we're really just embracing. We're having a ton of fun right now, so uh, we're excited to go to Dallas next week. I told you before the game this was going to be the result. I would have believed it, because the way I was thinking, if we break their press, I, I thought it could be a blowout. So um, just getting open looks and transition stuff, that's what we're really looking for. Uh, you broke their press, you also kind of broke their spirit at some point. Yeah, no, we just, and that's it, we don't want to take our, our foot off the gas, but we just wanted to keep going, keep going, and that's what we do all the time. One of the 16 teams. It's amazing, it's amazing, it's an honor. Pinch yourself a little bit? Yeah, a little bit. I mean, uh, it's, it's pretty cool being in a position where we're all in front right now. After months of going up against all these big 10 teams, did you feel like you guys could body them up a little bit? Yeah, uh, I mean, a little bit. I know we, that's one of the things that we've been lacking all year is kind of being physical. That, and like, that's what the big 10 kind of brings. And, uh, we, I think we did a real good job. We are rebounding them by a lot and uh, just in the game, walling up against other people. I mean, we did a really good job today. Looks like you guys, I mean, even you under the boards and driving hard, it's kind of down low that you were winning the battle because you guys had that size on them? Or? Yes. I mean, I don't, I don't know necessarily about the size, but we're just all aggressive today. That's the main thing. I know we know they're going to be really aggressive against us, and so we just want to uh, take it right back up. How, 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 uh, what can you say about Mitch? I think that was a career high for points, and he just kind of went off. It's a huge game for him, and I know his con I know he's really happy right now. His confidence going way up, so um, that's perfect momentum for us moving forward. What do you guys do for the next couple of days before you take off for the uh, I'm not sure yet. Uh, well, I guess we'll kind of look over some film tomorrow and then uh, figure out who we're playing next and start preparing for the game. Do you think it's like a completely different team in the league because it's confidence-wise and everything else? Yeah, I mean, I don't think we're completely different, but I mean, that, like just like you said, a little bit of confidence building up after these two games. Um, everyone has a real good spirit right now going on, so we're all just happy. How much does playing against non-Big Ten teams change the way Mitch plays and maybe open up maybe who he is as a player? Uh, it changes a little bit just because people uh, people can't scout us as hard as they do in Big Ten. I mean, Big Ten, everyone knows what everyone's going to do and all the sets, all the plays, and everyone's going to stop. Uh, Mitch just did a good job out there of staying ready and being aggressive on the boys. When you see his attitude out there on the court, when he's flying around, what does that do for you? It, man, it gets the whole crowd going, it gets the whole team going. We see him running around, diving for these balls and, and dunking the ball and screaming and stuff like that. That's an energy boost for the whole team.